This video is sponsored by Destination Canada, who has just released an original series titled Vacations of the Brave on Amazon Prime Video. Plan, but today we're doing asking strangers in a very different way. Thomas will explain. The odds of being alive are 1 in 10 followed by 2,640,000 zeros. To put that into perspective, it would be like having an entire city of 2 million people rolling a dice with 1 trillion sides and for everyone to land on the same number. Yet it's very easy to take life for granted. The premise of the show Vacations of the Brave is to surprise hardworking Americans with epic trips to Canada and take them to locations that'll challenge them physically, emotionally, and spiritually. And after watching the show, it inspired us to create a similar experience for a stranger who'd answer this simple yet extremely challenging question. If you had 24 hours left to live, what would you do? Our goal is to find a stranger who has a very specific and meaningful vision for what they'd want to do and then surprise them by turning that into reality. However, since everyone's first answer almost always seems to be... With my family. Okay, but assuming that you're like... <laughs> is that dumb? Is that like... No, no, cliche? assuming... Well, I... Do you want me to say something better? No, no, no. no. <laughs> we told everyone that for the purpose of this experiment, they can assume that they already spent time with their families. However, instead of doing things the conventional way, Amar came up with a different plan. So let's see if we can find a stranger and enable them to live one of the most meaningful days of their lives. I'm just really annoyed at this error right there. We made it just at the dimensions of this box so that we don't have a fucking thing sticking out like Dude, that. Dude, no one cares. <laughs> Only you are gonna care. I have so much respect for truck drivers right now. I, I, there's nothing. <laughs> After asking strangers on the street for over two hours, there was no answer that stood out. And so, Matt and Amar had no other choice but to try again the following day, but this time with reinforcement. You guys need Papa's help. What was that? I heard you guys need Papa's help. Who's Papa? I'm Papa, and I'm here. <laughs> I'm gonna go in. Day two. Let's see if it works. I think we gotta do it the old-fashioned way. We're just gonna go up straight to people. What do you wanna do before you die, huh? We're gonna f die tomorrow? That's not how we're gonna do it. The truck idea wasn't the most practical thing in the world, so we're going back out. What has been the number one thing on your bucket list? Ship to Iran. Yeah, travel around the world, the world with my family. Okay, well, I don't think that's the right strategy. <laughs> but we'll go too broad. Can we ask you a question? Yeah. Right. If you had 24 hours to live and you cannot leave California, how would you spend that? How many seconds do I get to answer? Oh, you can think about it by seconds. Yeah. Okay, okay, I know what I would do. So I'd eat like all the foods that I don't eat right now. Crepes, waffles, cheese, grilled cheese. And then I would jump off a cliff into the ocean. Do you guys want to come with me? Well, we would do the whole thing with you. We would. We would literally we would like the whole thing. Oh, like, we're actually going to do it? I would like being forgotten. Yeah. Take the question very seriously and actually think about every single detail because we can make it happen. Guys, are you sure? Yes. No, I feel like I shouldn't. What I actually want to do, and I'm not kidding, I told my mom this. I want to like drive up a mountain and howl, and I want the wolves to like come and so I can look at them. I can't believe we're doing that. Tomorrow, we're living our best lives. <laughs> <laughs> Morgan, I like you already. What time do we have to wake up? <laughs> if we got a last day to live, we gotta watch sunrise, right? All right, we're pulling her out of her stand and we're going into the mystery van, I guess. Do you have a favorite car? I keep having a dream about this like turquoise Ferrari. Turquoise Probably Ferrari. Probably not. Oh, is this it? You all? This is so pretty! Do well, I like, not get kidnapped? No. <laughs> oh my god, guys, you're freaking me out. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm, kidding. I'm kidding. We should compile a list of oh like, yeah. foods that you love. Well, I'm vegan. Okay. But I crave cheese every day. We need to drink wine. 
Okay. Red wine. We have to wake up, watch the sunrise, and probably go swimming. Guys, I feel like I'm actually dying. I thought you were just like fing around. You're like, what do you want to do? And I'm like, hmm. Well, so. Now we'll go back to the house, make a plan, and I'll see you a little later. Yay. Sweet. Good morning. It is currently 5 a.m. We are headed to downtown to pick up Morgan and her roommate will be joining us. We're starting off with cliff jumping, which is the only part that she knows about. She has no idea what's uh, happening for the rest of the day. Neither do you. Yeah. Wow, wow, the energy is high. I love it. I'm gonna be nice to meet you. you. I'm so f***ing ready, guys. It it's your last day, so I hope you're ready. I know. So oh, he cool. here's the thing about this cliff jumping place. It was affected by the Malibu fire, so we're 50-50 on knowing whether we can actually make it there. Oh, God. But we're gonna do our best. We have a friend who knows the cliff jumping spot who's coming with us, too. Yeah, so, is nobody cares about what I'm saying, right? Yeah. Yeah, nobody cares. I'll just, I'll just stop recording now. Nobody's been listening this whole time. <laughs> that was, that was, that was. Can we try it regardless? It's your last 24 like, hours. What would you want to do for sunrise? Let's go to the beach and we'll go swimming. We have to, we have to go. Yeah. Look at those views! the sunrise since you moved to LA. That's so sad. Wow, this is your first sunrise in LA? That's awesome though. <laughs> I'm so excited. We <laughs> have the best day ever together. Yay. Here we go. <laughs> you guys ready? I feel amazing. I'm ready. I'm ready, I'm ready, ready to go. Give me a high five. Yeah. We're doing it. <laughs> Best way to start the day, I would say. You have no idea what we're doing next, right? I have no idea. Okay, we'll tell you when we get there. So I'd be scared. All right, I'm already on a break to what we're actually about to do. I think the reason we end up picking you is because of your very specific vision <laughs> about howling with wolves. So we're going to a place called Wolf Mountain Sanctuary and it's by Big Bear. It was gonna be about a three hour drive, so we don't wanna waste your 24 hours driving. So we're gonna take a helicopter all the way out there. <laughs> we literally rented a helicopter for the morning to take us out there and then back. Guys, what the hell? You don't even know me. I don't even know what to do. That's like too nice. We can't waste time. Guys, I wanna go meet my, my family. We called them. My we wolf like, family. You guys are so nice. Like, I can't believe you're doing this. Never expected this. Like this is 10 times. This is crazy. This is like insane. <laughs> this is it. Hi. Awesome. Hi, Morgan. Be the pilot nice today. Hi, Anton. Hi. Nice to meet you. Never been in a helicopter. Cool. Nearby. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi. How are you guys? That was awesome. <laughs> Thank you so much for having us. Nice meeting you. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh. This is crazy. Do you feel the energy? Hi. Wow. That's to Connie, our alpha male. Which we don't go in with him because he can bite our faces off, so we don't want to go in. Oh, uh, okay. And oh, you, good to know. Oh, you got it? Wow. Yeah, they use Guys, this is nails. insane. You're yeah, so use pretty. those nails. How do you train a wolf to be comfortable around people? You don't you train picture? them, you give them love. Yeah. I've you been use with my phone wolves too. since I was two years old with my papa. So I know them, they know me. I'm part of them, they're part of me, and together we are one. Dude, we looking are... a wolf in the eye, yeah. seeing those canines, oh. You got better heart. Good girl. Yeah. She, like, she likes me, See? she can she make likes you. Oh my god. 
That was good. Oh, that's oh, cute. Nice. Uh, I'm trying to act yeah, cool right now. I'm the seventh she won't hurt me. I would have never thought I would That's ever catch a wolf in my entire life. This is a total tables turn situation okay. where the guest yeah. we brought along is not scared and Amar is scared for his life. That is my one fear. People always ask like, oh, what are you afraid of? Because like, I'm not usually afraid of like the heights and all these things. Wild animals is my biggest fear. Dude, I just got licked Aww, by a wolf. Come on, do it. <laughs> wow. So what he's going to do is call so if you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'm at my wolf pack tribe. Do it, do it with them. That gave me goosebumps. Yeah, that was mission accomplished? Mission accomplished. Awesome. I have a wolf. Now, now I am a wolf. <laughs> also, every single wolf here has been rescued by her. It was being here or it was being put down. So she's been taking care of all these wolves for several years now. Well, we'll fly back to LA and continue the day. Okay, we are currently on our way to pick up the Ferrari. Never thought I'd say those words. <laughs> Holy sh Oh my god. Wait, what? I am back home and wow. Wow. Holy sh! What the hell, dude? <laughs> I will be driving out to downtown right now to pick her up, surprise her with this, take her on an epic ride on Pacific Coast Highway, one of the most scenic drives in the world, and then we're gonna be surprising her with wine and cheese at this epic spot in Malibu that Thomas discovered a few months ago. Hi, Morgan, what do you think we're doing right now? I have no idea what we're doing. Wait, should I be scared, guys? Uh, Something. Morgan, you gave us like a list of a lot of things <laughs> you possibly wanted to do yesterday. So you can go right here, and then you can open your eyes. That is too funny. Is it? Is that real? It's ours. How did Dang. you do that? It this was is so fucking weird. Easy. Yeah, I'm like, I don't even know what to say. This is weird. I've like never even dream. seen a Ferrari before. I don't think. In my dream. I feel she's not even like processing. What's I can't process because that will like be too overwhelmed. That's <laughs> good. I know that this was uh, not too high on your list, but we thought it would still be fun. No, this is like, it was so high that I was gonna take it off because I was like, I don't want you to feel pressured to do it. You're driving? Yes, I'm driving. This very expensive vehicle. Oh, you have to like really press it. I need to make sure I know where the, where the brake is. What do you mean know where the brake is? Sometimes I like try to hit the brake, but I hit the gas. Oh, no, we can't have that. Look at, look at the sign. Yeah, yeah, let's just I look know. at the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, girl. Yeah. I feel like a badass. Okay. <laughs> All right, we made it to the location. We didn't die. <laughs> And the car's good. Walking down the most epic lookout spot that I know of so far in Los Angeles. Oh, I love it. Oh, my boyfriends are here. You have eight boyfriends for the day. Oh, my boyfriend! <laughs> Hi! Guys, this is dope as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Guys! You wanted wine and cheese, right? That's two boxes. Are we doing this I was going to do this, yeah. Oh, okay. It really does feel like a date now. So Morgan is a vegan and doesn't eat cheese, but for her last 24 hours, she will. Yes! I want to know which is my seat. This is goat cheese. That looks so Oh my god, sassy. look at that. So as a part of your last 24 hours, you wanted to give back. Yes, I want to give my crystal healing energy to random people that we see. Let's do it. I know you're working, but I wanted to give you a crystal. Thank you. It's called Aquamarine. I know a little bit about crystals. Really? It's cool. Yeah, Have cool. a good night. Have a good night, guys. Thank you. Yeah. Very nice of cool. you. So that's for you. Thank you. Have, Have a good day. Day. Oh. It's called Aquamarine. Thank you. But I'll take it. Can I get a hug too? Yeah. Thank you kindly. Thank you. Act of kindness. Mission complete. completed. And you know what we're doing now? We're gonna have an epic vegan dinner. I'm so excited. Let us go. I think it's your birthday. I know. Well, it's it's her like surprise. <laughs> After living through this experiment alongside Morgan, it pushed all of us to think about how we spend our time. What are the things that matter most to us? Who are the people we want to be surrounded by? And what do we do in our daily lives to seek those things out? I was like, if I actually did die tomorrow, that would be fine. Because today was so f***ing surreal. Like, I literally feel so full. Like, my heart is so full. This is actually insane to me. I walk into this house and a whole bunch of strangers are like, hi! 
I've never felt this much love in my life. Oh. Now, as 2018 comes to an end, we want to challenge you to identify one thing that you'd actually want to do if you had 24 hours left to live and go find a way to make it happen. And to spread the love, make a list of the people who you'd want to surround yourself with and tell them how much they mean to you. On that note, we'll be doing exactly that. This is the last video of 2018 as we'll be taking the next three weeks off to reflect and spend time with loved ones. Happy holidays to all the YesFam members out there. We're so grateful for this community and we can't wait to show you what we have planned for 2019. We'll be posting exclusive videos on our Instagram while we're off YouTube, so follow us on there. And we also highly encourage you to click the link in the description and check out Vacations of the Brave, which is available on Amazon Prime Video right now. If you want to continue being inspired and maybe get some ideas for things you want to experience yourself, click the link in the description and enjoy the show. So thanks again to Destination Canada for sponsoring this video. We love you all. We'll see you in 2019.